It's absolutely wonderful to, to be here at this great celebration of campaigning, which I think is just so vital to civil society, democracy and, and the rule of law. It is humbling to be amongst real campaigners and great campaigners like Tony Juniper and, and Terry Waite. I, I, I kind of see myself as a recovering lawyer stroke professional teenager. You know, the, the, the government does something really wicked and, and I say, I really hate that and I really, do you know what, I really hate you. <laughs> You're going to ruin my life. Well, n not quite. Sometimes we try to be a little bit more sophisticated than that. I am otherwise known as the Grim Reaper. <laughs> if, you, if you see me everywhere on John's programme or elsewhere, you know that something pretty bloody awful is happening. <laughs> um, but, 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 not, but not here today when I think something pretty wonderful is, um, it, it, it is happening. Um, I came to Liberty, the National Council for Civil Liberties, the day before 9-11. Um, uh, John very kindly says that uh, my organisation ha has done a lot to raise the profile of fundamental rights and freedoms in this country. We couldn't sadly have done it without the help of President Bush and, uh, and Mr Blair as well. But, but more positively, out of adversity comes opportunity. And that's what I think all the people in this room know that you can take terrible times, terrible crises, terrible policies and turn them around by raising awareness and coming up with alternative solutions to some of the most challenging, difficult problems that the world faces today.